Hashtag not sponsored. Hello people, I did plan this video in advance because I knew there were some things that are going to happen because um, some things have changed and I have yet to see the lobby, I have yet to see the full release of Blocks, Blocks and Island. I call them Blocks again, by accident, I'm sorry, don't come at me, but I have yet to see the full release of the Reborn version, so I have no idea where to start. Hello there newcomer, thank you for this. Hello there newcomer, thank you for deciding to join the retaliation, we can really use for your help. My name is Miles, I am in charge of the squadron. Let's get right into your first mission, shall we? Welcome to Bloxton Island. It is one of the smallest known landmasses, and it was used as a military airport in ancient times. Now, it's been overrun by a tribe of goblins. If you uh, goblins of Gashak, they were supposedly banished hundreds of years ago. Somehow, they managed to return to this world through the rift portal. We need to destroy it. We need to destroy it and find out uh, where it came from. You'll start out on this beach and fight your way to the goblin base above. There are three towers, each with levers, that, that you need to climb in order to progress to the portal. However, they are guarded by strong goblin juggernauts who are who appear to be holding the keys to the tower that are guiding. Guiding? Guiding? Guarding. Once you make it past the tower, you'll be at the goblin base. There you'll be able to take down the portal. At the time, I will send down the PDD, the portal disruption device. Activate it and the portal will become solid and vulnerable, also blocking goblins from coming through. The Effect is only temporarily. However, so you may, you need to activate it multiple times to completely destroy this. Okay, so I did not see that during like the testing of Blocks and Island, the Reborn version. So this is new to me. Now let's talk about the boat you just boarded. It's called the Sea Porter. You, we have five of them located across the globe, retailing against the invading army. Ah, there you are! The device behind you is called the Island Gate. You can use it to travel to other islands when you will unlock them. There are a few services stationed on the sea porter, like the weapon shop for instance. And, oh wow, I really like this lobby. It's much more like, fits the theme of Monster Islands than just like a, like your typical like, waiting, 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 waiting room. Because it takes you to like, well, I mean, I could show like a clip of like what the old lob what lobby looked like. It's like I would say it's like Soul Wars. Um, ooh, boss main stages. New lobby. I really like it so far. I have to maybe like just walk around for a bit and like maybe get used to it because you know, coming back here yeah, for like a bit and yeah. Here is the Robux shop. You can buy special skins, exclusive weapons, gold, and other stuff here. And this is the uh, SRTP, the Short Range Teleportation Pass. This is how you will start your mission. Use this device to teleport onto the island. You'll get a chance to configure your loadout when you do. The device travels both ways too. If you want to escape and return to the sea portal, click the escape button at the bottom right of your screen. It'll appear once you're on the island. Well, that's everything you need to know to get started. Your comrades have probably already started to fight, so go join them when you're ready. If you have any questions, you can use your communication orb to contact me. It's a button at the bottom right corner of your screen. It should be right here. You may also get incoming calls from it, indicating by a flashing exclamation mark. So make sure to answer them. Alright, that's it. Good luck. That is actually like... Um, to me, it's like, 
the beginning is very convenient because it gives like the new players to know like what they are doing instead of like you know hey here you're in the lobby now go have fun but I like the little like little introduction like any other game I feel like any action game should have like an introduction of some sort of, like where to start on if you're a new player or so. Alright, so I guess I'm gonna give my uh, opinion on this and please don't come at me at what I'm gonna say. Um, this is actually way different from the older lobby because um, this is smaller and the older lobby, like from the inside, it looked like a industry like or so and I kinda felt to me that didn't really fit with like the atmosphere. When you're building a game, you need to have like some type of atmosphere. And I really like how we're on a boat, and this is the lobby, and I actually like it that we're on a boat. It kind of fits with the entire MI thing. And also you have like individual shops and storage because it's more convenient than just having a, a big gray room with couches and like other games and just also islands. It kind of felt a bit empty. Hello, the steel eagle here. Creator of Monster Island. Well done on completing your first island. That was just a taste of a new game I call Reef 1. But I haven't got to it yet. <laughs> okay, well we'll get to it to this video and I'll see how things go. The next four islands have not been have not have not yet received this miracle of a house. So don't be surprised if the next island you visit feels completely different from what you just played. Follow me on Twitter at the Real Sea Legal to keep track of updates and learn more about the upcoming reward island. Cheer! Yes! I freaking hype for this. Um, if you guys really want to follow Sea Legal, I will link his Twitter in the description in the description box so you can go check out any updates. On a scale of one to ten, I give it a nine point five. Okay, I didn't give it a ten. I have a reason for it. I like to give a little suggestion. Because I again I felt like there needs to be something in the middle that could go into consideration but really don't want to take up too much space of this despite this being like tiny. Maybe I would have like you know uh like you know the major the major developers of this game because so people could know like what really goes into the game or so. I'm a little bit confused on how the charging works, but I'm pretty sure that um, I'll do this island again because I missed the entire thing. I uh, forgot to record my reaction to the, first, to the improved cutscene, so um, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. I'm saying that way too many times now. Oh, human destroy pool! We smash you! Oh, here we go. Keep coming back here. Is it normal to happen? Also, hmm. Weird. Don't know if it's a bug or not. What's supposed to happen? I'm so confused. Maybe I'll just like equip some some weapons here, and then we go good to go. Okay, then my armor. Oh. Yeah, even though, huh? My arm is invisible. But it's there. Maybe I should have to check that and check all the time to like make it to make it like not there. All right, a wave of goblin is coming.
Where's the last one? What the heck? Well, um... Oh, there it is! Okay. Human and not give the human I sound nothing like him. And I'm not even trying to sound like him. Okay. I mean he couldn't be that bad. Well I mean for someone this this high. No bragging by the way. Okay, let's go. Let's unlock the gate. Activate the freaking Ah! Uh, oh, blah, 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 I can't do that. No. No. Okay. And... And here comes the classic drawbridge. And we are gonna suffer seriously. Oh my god! Oh! No! Oh! Uh, sorry, we didn't mean to disturb you there, sir. Um, we were just saving humanity from... Heck. Human, we need reinforcements. God, these, I thought you guys were supposed to cut trees. Okay, well, I was disrupting you. You didn't need to attack me for goddamn sakes. Okay, the lower gate. Lower gate? Town gate has opened. T climb in and pull the lever to open the gate. Actually, I can let dead people do this. I'm just gonna go here and. The gate has opened. Climb the rocks to advance. Well, I'm jumping all the way up here. Me, if. Oh, you have an incoming. Calling your communication log. Uh, well, I mean, I can check that later and see what's up, but it, I think some messages like repeat. And, yeah, that's. Okay, here comes the really entertaining, hilarious cutscene that we've all been waiting for. I guess I could say it's a big improvement, an improvement from like. Last time, I guess. Rack! Human must be destroyed! Pen staff! Of course! His... His usual entrance. <laughs> He's like a- Pen staff! Attack the ugly human! Of course, so why doesn't that surprise me that he would make this dramatic entrance? Oh god, where did he go? Right! Right. Right, he doesn't move. You just have to attack as fast as you can because. Oh dear. No! Uh, I need to look on that. Oh, I thought he was a. I thought he was a freaking. Um. Like one of those guys. What the heck? Uh. Eh. No. Oh. Oh, what the heck? He was there for a brief second. Uh, where did he go now? Oh no, I'm gonna die. Oh, there he is! Oh god. Okay, he's all the way there. Uh, I'm just gonna go on my left. This guy teleports like too much. There's a moment to hate enemy. There we go! He did. Human defeat Ben's death. Goblin comes to for the Ben's death is down. Sending in the PDD. Okay, so it charges on the own. We don't need to do the work, I guess. Oh, so while it's charging, I guess we can't. Okay, there we go. Human breaking portal. Smash human device. Human attacking portal. Stop the. Ask him. Destroy your portal! Me smash you!
another rare. Okay. Let's, uh... Ooh, I want to try that now. Hello, my name is Dane. We're not talking about Dane Vine, okay? Okay. I am a judge of by other squadron. We need- we all need for a backup. I have a walk by Ellen for you at Island's Gate. Get here when you can. Well... I mean, when I already came here, it's already like a lot, so... There's a classic and then there's a new one. I am super excited for this one. Just because... Things are gonna happen, also. But I really don't think Dane is mentioning about like the classic. Maybe he's just mentioning about Reborn, which I think Reborn should be in the works or so. Oh boy, what's the incoming call for the communication talk? Greetings, I am the Nera. I am, and I'm contacting you from the Qatar Island, but we need your help from here. I have a lot of Qatar Island. You at the end gate, get out of here when you can. Okay, I guess it keeps going. That's Arvin. Um, I guess. Okay. Okay, I think it's because I. The reason why these red notifications are coming out is because I think I've already unlocked them a year ago. So I guess anytime if you want some help, you just go to question mark and just put it up here. Well, so, um, so, I guess that's all we're going to do for today, and thank you guys so much for watching, I'm literally, like, excited to see the Reborn of Fight Island and Exuerith Island. Actually, Exuerith Island is the one I'm looking forward to the most, and just see, like, how really intense it is. Um, uh, I almost fell off. Great. That's not cool at all. I will link this game down below in the description box if you want to go check it out. And I will also link Steel's Twitter if you want to go follow him and see what updates come. Hashtag not sponsored. 